for tuning in to The Other 167. It's such an honor to share this message with you today. I am Pearl Vadukut Golar from Hosanna Church Ministries, Mumbai. The Bible tells us, Jesus said in Luke 8, 18, Therefore take heed how you hear, for whoever has to him more will be given, and whoever does not have even what he seems to have will be taken from him. This word seems to be so important. When you listen to it, it talks about things that you have will be taken from you. And if you don't have also, if you listen carefully, you will gain what you don't have. Jesus has emphasized on hearing. Many a times when we read scripture, we just read it casually. But Jesus over here is telling us that when you hear something, you need to be very careful how you hear and what you hear. Let me illustrate this. Whatever you hear has an impact on you. It could be an impact that brings fear. It could be something that builds your faith. I once read a story of a little boy, a young man in fact, who was told that he would be part of an experiment where they were going to have this very venomous uh, serpent, a snake, bite him. Okay, And he was blindfolded. So the experimenters blindfolded him and told him that this serpent is going to bite you, but don't worry, uh, you know, we know all the things that will happen after that. So the moment you get bitten by the serpent, the poison through the fangs of the snake are going to enter your bloodstreams. You're going to feel all of it going through your body and you're going to see, you know, your organs of your body shutting down, paralysis happen, all this is going to happen to you. Mind you, this boy was blindfolded and they kept telling him all these things. The truth is this, they never used the snake to prick him. They just used a needle to prick the boy on his hand. And you won't believe it. Even though no poison was administered to him, the snake did not bite him. This boy died in a matter of seconds. That is the impact of fear. Whenever we listen to something that brings fear, it has the same impact on us because our bodies and our minds begin begins to work according to what we hear. You see, the hormones in our body, our blood pressure, everything gets regulated, changes depending on what we hear. Therefore, Jesus is warning us that we should not listen to things that cause us to be fearful, things that cause us to be afraid, things that make us scared. The Bible is very clear. Faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. Romans 10, 17. Today, if you have your Bible, you have everything you need. As you read your Bible, as you hear it out, as you listen to it carefully, faith will rise up within you. Take heed what you hear because everything you hear is going to impact you. Have a lovely day. God bless.